Greetings, my beautiful lovelies. It's Emmy. How are you? It's great to see you and welcome back. Today's video is sponsored by Colliders, which takes your favorite candy flavors and collides them with new flavors and textures. I'm super excited to taste these. I got as many flavors as possible that I could find at my supermarket. And I'm so curious to see these new takes on very, very familiar flavors. And when I mean familiar flavors, I mean like this. Reese's peanut butter cups collided with a creamy vanilla dessert. So let's go ahead and give these a go. There are different collisions here, and this is the twisted version. Package comes with two of them. It comes in a pod like this, and look at that. And then you just take these two halves and you flip it. Fun! See all the Reese's peanut butter cups chopped up on that spoon? Alrighty, let's give this a taste. Itadakimasu. Mmm. That is cool and decadent. The first thing I taste is the peanut butter chocolate combination of Reese's peanut butter cups, but it's chopped up really finely. So it's a really nice texture contrast to that really smooth and cool and creamy vanilla base underneath. One of my favorite things about Reese's peanut butter cups is the amount of salt, and that saltiness goes so well with the sweetness of the vanilla. Mm. Now this version is the Reese's Collider's Layered. So this one's a little bit different because the Reese's peanut butter cups have actually been transformed into a dessert in itself. Mmm. This dessert is perfect for a day like this. It is scorchingly hot outside, and this is so cool and smooth. Mm -hmm. The top part has a really rich chocolate flavor, and beneath it, not surprisingly, is the peanut buttery custard underneath with that same smooth, decadent texture. And it tastes kind of enriched, a little bit creamy. What I really like is that they actually put the peanut butter beneath the chocolate, just like you would find in a regular peanut butter cup. Next, we have this one. I'm super excited about this because I love the combination of mint and chocolate. Now, I know this can be a little bit contentious for some people like my mom who thinks mint and chocolate just taste like toothpaste, but I, on the other hand, because taste is subjective, adore the combination of chocolate and mint. Look at that color. Isn't that great? It reminds me of mint chip ice cream. And it smells it too. Mm-hmm. Mm. This totally elicits those sensors in your brain that say grasshopper pie, mint chip ice cream. Yes, totally on target. I like the size of these chocolate bits. They're thin, so you get that nice kind of snap. They're not too large where it overpowers the mint flavor. It's a really nice balance of chocolate and mint. Here's another interpretation of a classic candy, and it's for Rolos, Rolos! And this is a layered version, so we're gonna have two layers of dessert here. If you've never had a Rolo before, a Rolo is a caramel candy that is coated in chocolate, and they have a very distinctive shape to them. Similar to the Reese's Peanut Butter Cup, we have the chocolate on the top and the caramel flavor underneath, which I think is great, because that's how a Rolo is assembled as well. There we have it. There's the caramel and the chocolate. Mmm, so very, very smooth. I like when you take a bite that it combines both of those flavors together. The bottom layer is a classic caramel flavor, that kind of buttery cooked sugar flavor, along with that very rich chocolate on the top. Mm hmm Which is milky and chocolatey and takes you back to your childhood days. So I think what separates the layer version from the twisted and the chop is just the emphasis on the smooth, buttery, silky texture. Next I have Kit Kat, and this is a twisted version. So this is a collision of vanilla dessert with chopped up Kit Kats on top. Let's try the spooning and the dipping. Oh, yeah. Mm-hmm. 
This one has a slightly different contrast of textures. We have that smooth, very rich vanilla base. And then we've got the Kit Kat crumble pieces on top, which have that familiar crackly cookie wafery bit inside. And then that milk chocolate that is on top. So you have a slight crunch, the bite of the chocolate, and then the smooth, cool vanilla underneath. Oh, it's like nostalgia. Next, we have this one, and this is the classic Hershey candy bar, and this is a chopped version. So we're gonna have chopped chocolate bits on top, but instead of a vanilla base, we have a chocolate. So this is gonna be double chocolate. I like the dipping. I think the dipping is really fun. Mm-hmm. Mmm, the chocolate pieces are dark chocolate, so they have a slight bitterness, more like a bittersweet or a semi-sweet. And then the chocolate base is milk chocolate, creamy, rich, and milky. So you have that really great combination of chocolate flavors that are contrasting yet like, so it just kind of heightens this whole chocolate experience. If you are a chocolate lover, then this one is the one for you. My last one is this one. This is the Hershey's Cookies and Cream Colliders Twisted. So this is gonna be the vanilla base with chopped cookies on top. Mm -hmm. Here are the cookie pieces. This one I'm gonna sprinkle right on top. Swirl that in. I love that you can customize each bite. If I want a little bit more extra cookie on that, I can just go boom. Here we go. Mmm! That's the crunchiest collider that I've had. The cookies add a huge crunch, as I hope you could hear. And this particular combination of cookie and custard totally reminds me of a pie. When you have a cookie or a graham cracker crust and then you've got that really smooth, cool, custardy filling, that's what this reminds me of. This is like pie. <laughs> Mm -hmm. Alrighty, my lovelies, there you have it. That was my Collider's taste test, which take your favorite candy flavors and twists, chops, and layers them into new, cool, spoonable, and delicious desserts. Big thanks to Collider's for sponsoring this video. Thank you so much for watching. I hope you enjoyed that one. I hope you learned something. Please share this video with your friends. Follow me on social media, like this video, subscribe, and I shall see you in the next one. Toodaloo. Take care. Bye.